things that go by the same name can actually be quite different. Take joint health supplements. Cosamin is the only glucosamine chondroitin sulfate brand proven effective in published clinical studies. And now, Cosamin is available in a more potent formula, Cosamin ASU. Cosamin, anything less just isn't the best. For more information and special offers, visit helpyourjoints.com. Hi, welcome back and thanks for joining us. You know, in order to be an NFL player, you have to be quick on your feet. One day, Trevor Price was playing for the Baltimore Ravens. The day after we interviewed him, he was playing for the Jets. Now, none of this changed Trevor's passion for the game. Trevor Price is this week's Your Life Story. Hi, I'm Trevor Price for the Baltimore Ravens, and I play defensive end. Well, I was born in New York, and uh, my life really started in Florida. The Pee Wee teams, there was a uh, age and weight limit, and I was too heavy to play at my age and too young to play at the next weight limit. I spent my whole, um, my whole life before ninth grade, before ninth, tenth grade, you know, hoping and you know wishing I could play, but I couldn't. You know, what I mean, it is, I couldn't play it. I was in uh, ninth grade and I played. Um, they put me at tight end and running back and linebacker, and I, I couldn't catch. Um, I was kind of so I'm very slew footed, so my feet go out. You know, what I mean, still to this day. So I wasn't all that fast. I wanted to quit, and my mom, my mom wouldn't let me quit. She's like, "No, you want to play? You're gonna play this year." Then, by the end of the season, I remember, it, I remember not wanting it to end. I was like, "I wish this could go on because I had so much fun doing it." They moved me up to varsity as a, I was 13 years old, I think. <laughs> yeah, I was 13, and I was like, "What am I doing up here?" And they were like, "You're gonna be a big-time player for us." My high school coach was a guy named Bob Irving, yeah, our defensive coordinator, and he was a. Uh, he was like, you could be something. I went to Michigan, left Michigan, transferred, became a defensive lineman from a linebacker. I was pretty good at it because I could run fast. Um, entered the draft because all of a sudden one day, I think somebody told me, oh, you're going to be a first round pick. I was like, no, I'm not. And then I read in some paper, you're going to be a first round pick. I was like, oh my God. So it, it always became that thing where it was, um, at least me, um, I was never good until somebody told me I was good. The second Super Bowl, that uh, I won in Denver. First one I didn't do much for. The second one I was, I played almost every snap. So and and I remember that's another time that I that I remember walking out of facility one day wishing the season went in because I was having such a good time. I'm Jamaican. You know, my, my my dad is a to this day is a fantastic soccer player. My sister played in the women's U.S. women's national team. It's been a part of my life ever since I can remember. It's react constantly, unlike football, where it's like react for a few moments, okay, let's stop and regroup. It's react, 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 stop, react, react, run, run, jog, jog, stop, react, react, move, move, yeah, oh my God, you know what I mean? So that's the big thing, and, and I, I never got to the point, as much as I did it, I never got to the point I could play 90 minutes of a, of a game, you know what I mean? So, but the more I did it, the more I realized it was hard on my cardiovascular system. If you spend 365 days a year playing football, you know, you, you only have so many reps in you. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't care how old you are. Your body says, okay, you have this much football in you. Now, if I spend half my year doing football, half my year doing other stuff, I want to use a little bit. But if I spend my entire year, I'd use a lot of it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Think of it as a, think of it as a candle, you know, and you're burning it on both ends. Football, 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 football. It's 365 days a year. Now you, you've burned up 12 months when you only have 46 months in you. You burned up 12 instead of burned up six. I would like to, you know, take whatever little celebrity I have and say, look, let's try something different. You know what I mean? Let's, we all don't have to do the same thing. I would like to expose a lot of kids in a city like Baltimore. I like to expose them to things like tennis and soccer and otherworldly things. Everybody should play a sport. Not everybody needs to play football, but everybody should play a sport. We want to thank Trevor for sharing his uplifting story with us. We wish him the very best. Now, if you have an inspirational story to tell, share it with us. Log on to our show's website, yourlifetv.com. Who knows, you may be a future Your Life Story.